Good evening, Ludlow, Massachusetts! And on behalf of the Eastern Wrestling Alliance, I'd like to welcome you here at the Elks Lodge for tonight's EWA Extravaganza, ladies and gentlemen. Before we get started with the announcements, I would like to introduce my broadcast. By the way, my name is Rich Palladino. I'm sorry if you all came to see Bobby Cruz. Great ghost, I apologize for that. Uh, my name is Rich Palladino. I'll be doing commentary for uh, EWA Home Video. With that in mind, I'd love to call out to the commentary position my broadcast partner, formerly one of the most illustrious managers here in the EWA. Please welcome Dr. a young four-year-old who has been diagnosed with cancer. So it's a very worthy cause. Christopher's doing all right. We're hoping he's going to be at the event. Tonight we're going to be doing a 50-50 raffle we'd like to ask you to participate in. Raffle tickets will be on sale during the course of tonight's events. One dollar a piece, or you can get an entire arm's length for just five dollars. We're going to raffle off half of that money to you fans, whoever should win tonight. 50% of that will go to you, 50% will go to Christopher's fundraising fund, I guess we can call it. And in addition, you will also pick up the last time we were in Ludlow, which was October 18th of 2003. We got the home video from that event. So please be sure to pick up a, a uh, raffle ticket tonight here at the Elks Lodge. And with that, I think that's it, ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to direct your attention to the video wall, ladies and gentlemen. As we open with the customary EWA video. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Just a small sample of what you're going to see right here tonight in Ludlow, Massachusetts. I got one question. Are you guys ready? Yeah. All right, then. It gives me great pleasure to introduce your ring announcer, ladies and gentlemen, my good friend. Please welcome Mr. Tommy D.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is Dr. Everett Payne here with another exciting night of action with the Eastern Wrestling Alliance. And I am so happy to finally say, not by my side is Bobby Cruz. Instead, my new play-by-play -play commentator, none other than the great Rich Palladino. Well, thank you very much, Dr. Payne. I was going to tell the fans here on EWA Home Video not to pop the video cassette out of their VCR because Bobby Cruz is not here tonight. My good friend Bobby Cruz, I know you guys had your differences. Of course, of course. But I am Rich Palladino, honored to be here with you. Let's go back up to Tommy D for the introduction of Andre Lyon's opponent. Well, the very popular good time Vince Vicalo Returning here to Ludlow to take on high-flying Andre Lyons, one half of Clinically Inclined. Well, you know, it's because Vicaro has a lot in common with your average wrestling fan. Not much upstairs, just in it for the good times. Well, like these fans here. Well, it, it, it's no secret to any uh, fans of New England wrestling here in, uh, here in the EWA. Vince Vicalo is the epitome of good times. Likes to tip a couple back every now and again and definitely epitomizes his nickname of good times and just loves to have a great time anywhere he goes. And Vicalo taking on a relative newcomer here to the EWA, Andre Lyons, perhaps in I believe his fifth match or so, making quite an impact for a young star. High-flying Andre Lyons, his tag team partner, Dr. Reginald Heresy, they are known as clinically inclined. And the young rookie has really learned a lot from his mentor, the good doctor, the former two-time EWA champion. Of course, Harris is showing what a trainer he can be because, like I said, Lions, not much experience, but every time I see this kid get out there, he's showing me something new, he's showing me something I like. Yeah, definitely puts his body at risk. A high flyer, as the high-flying nickname would uh, epitomize. And right now it's Vicalo going behind with the hammerlock, reversed by the high-flying one, Andre Lyons. It's going to be interesting here in this startup here to see how Lyons does taking on the much more experienced Vicalo. Vicalo with a good five, six years of experience, trained by the legendary Walter Killer Kowalski. Of course, assisted by Coach Mike Hollow, and he has really learned his craft very well. And uh, the, the fruits of his labor have really paid off with a lot of recent events being called for uh, working backstage and working some dark matches for World Wrestling Entertainment. So, Vicalo, definitely one of the future superstars, not just of the Northeast, but I believe perhaps the entire country. And But what a feather in the cap would it be for Andre Lyons to actually pull out a victory here against someone like Vicalo, someone with such an incredible win streak going here in the EWA. I think unprecedented, possibly. Vince Vicalo has not been pinned in the EWA since September of 2002. That, that is incredible. Here we are in 2004, a year and a half now he's gone without a pinfall. And the man we're going to be seeing in tonight's main event, of course, our EWA heavyweight champion, Maverick Wild. What a great champ. What a great champ he is. Well, yeah, well, you say what you will. Maverick Wild, I'll give him credit. A 13-year veteran, the first NEI Invitational Champion. Recently defended his title against Vicalo and had to use a steel chair to... Uh, get himself disqualified. I, I don't know if I'd say he had to. I, I think he more just chose to. I, I, it's on how you look at it. It's perspective, really. Well, you see it your way. I'll see it mine. I'm sure we're going to get along just fine of here, course, Dr. Of Payne. course. I had my problems with Bobby Cruz, but you look a little brighter than he did. That, that's not saying that much, but I, I got hope for you, Rich. Stick close to me. I'll, I'm, I'll get you in good with some of the boys out back. I, I would appreciate that. A lot of new faces to me backstage, so fans, I'm going to try my best to call this action tonight. And a high knee to the chest by Andre Lyons knocks Vicalo down to the mat. And speaking of new phase, we're going to see a lot of newcomers here in the EWA tonight here in Ludlow, Mass. Some coming from CZWs and some that we haven't seen in a while coming back, making their return. It's going to be an exciting night here tonight, Rich. The best in New England here tonight for the Eastern Wrestling Alliance. And speaking of the best, let's talk about the official here, Todd Fat Pants Sinclair, one of the finest officials in all of New England, if not the entire Eastern Seaboard. Well, I don't know if that's saying much. I mean, I don't really have the most high regard for referees. I, I find most of them to be uh, actually probably a step behind your average wrestling fan, mentally. You could say that, well, but you know, Fat Pants really goes out there, he really enforces the law, and he doesn't take any guff from these wrestlers. And there we go, town to Ludlow, uh, almost a sellout house here tonight, Rich, coming alive, and just that, what a lively crowd already here, getting to see one of the best in the Northeast here, Vince Vicalo, what a way to start off a night. Vicalo now sets up off center rope, High flying clothesline by Vince Vicalo. Good time, Vince Vicalo. Setting up for another clothesline, takes him down to the mat. Vicalo, a very fiery opponent. He gets in there and just explodes out of nowhere. 
energy personified Vince Vicalo as he goes down for a count of two. Uh, I'm sure the healthy buzz he has going on getting into the ring doesn't hurt that at all. No, not at all. I'd like to thank Vicalo for taking some time out of his AA meeting tonight to help uh, to show up tonight. I was just going to say, you said the key word buzz, and that is a word that is synonymous with good time Vince Vicalo. You got a different kind of buzz right there, Rich, with that kick to the face. Yeah, and I know all too well because I, I do, on, on a personal level, travel with Vince Vicalo quite a bit, so... He's one of a kind. Oh, you can say that again. And Andre Lyons with a two count on the veteran, Vince Vicalo. And like you said earlier, this would be quite a feather in the cap of Andre Lyons if he should pull out a big upset victory over Vince Vicalo. Lyons seemed to think that fat pants perhaps a little slow on that count. I got to say, I kind of agree. Ludlow coming alive again. And Andre now looks like he's making his way up to the top. Oh, he wants to put this one home. And he's up there. Oh! oh! Goes for his swanton bomb and comes up with nothing but a back full of canvas. Vicalo's only chance. Vicalo has to rally now if he wants a chance against this youngster. He's got to take advantage while he can. Goes with a boot to the midsection. This is the good times roll, baby. He cut it. One, two, and oh. three. Big win for Vince Vicalo. Let's go to Tommy D. Well, there's the music. There we go. Vicalo continuing that win streak here in the EWA. Can anyone beat him? We're talking 16 months and going strong. Lions, though, what an incredible effort from the youngster. Taking on a man with just much, much more experience than him, but giving it a good going. What a great opening match we just saw, Rich. Outstanding. Two great young athletes. And uh, we're going to be back very shortly. We're going to see uh, a video, uh, Kid Crazy and Minnie, and then they're going to go on uh, a big rematch. Kid Crazy and the Mighty Minnie, one-on-one, -on -one, coming up next.